Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'll be showing you how to get cursed jewel katanas in Blocks Fruits. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. Let's get straight into the video. Alright, so right now I'm at the mansion in the third sea. And the first thing you'll have to do is get both Toshida and Yama to minimum 400 mastery. Then what you're going to want to do is go behind the mansion and go up the mountain behind it. Over there is a door, and the door will be closed, so to open it, you go to the opposite side the door is at, talk to this guy, he'll open it for you, and then you can head through the door. First scroll is the Toshida scroll, it says Doc Legend, Sense of Duty, Soulless. Click First Trial, Doc Legend, and to complete this one, you have to go to three different docks and ask dock guys, pardon me. <laughs> Alright, this is the first dock. You can either go to the luxury boat dealer or the boat dealer. Press next, next again, go pardon me. They'll say they recognize you and then all you have to do is that two more times. That's the second time. Now just one more. And there's the third one and they gave me an Alucard Fragment. The scroll reacts to your achievements. So the Alucard Fragment is in Valuables. There we go. Now head back to the scrolls. All right, go back to the scroll. It says the same thing. Second trial is Sense of Duty. For Sense of Duty, you have to kill at least one pirate in the pirate raid and it has to be completed, AKA kill all the pirates. All right, so the pirates are just spawned and there we go. They are raiding the castle on the sea. Now I just need to finish the raid. This is the last enemy. There we go. Obtained Alucard Fragment. So now I'm heading back to the scrolls. Here we go. Third trial, Soulless. You're going to want to go to Big Mum. When you're at Big Mum, you're going to have to kill it. Now if you can hear that, it's this weird noise going on right now. That's because of what I'm doing right now. And there we go. So I talked to some people and it turned out that I had to kill her before the music ended. I think I have to do that again. Alright, so because I'm lazy, I'm just going to respawn the bosses. If you're having trouble killing it, Kate Queen before the music ends, which is, I think, two minutes, then you should get someone else to get it, like, halfway or something before you start, because as soon as you hit the Kate Queen, the music starts, right? She's pretty low, like, half health, so I'm gonna just start right now. Yes! There we go! <laughs> So now, what I have to do is find three torches and then kill the uh, things that spawn from them. Oh, is this the third one? Oh, these ones have... Uh, I think they have... Uh, fruit? That one does. Yeah, that one definitely does. And there we go, that's the last one. So I head through here, and there's the third Alucard fragment. Now, right now, the Yammer scroll is active. So the first one's Pain and Suffering. So the Pain and Suffering is to either die to an NPC or get really low and then get the Alucard Fragment. How about over here? And now it works! I guess it's only on Hydra Island where you have to get really low from an enemy. Alright, so now the second trial for the Yama Scroll is Haze of Misery. This one sucks. Someday, oh, 
Finally, I did that. And just as pirates arrived too, so I'll just go kill them. Lame food. Right, so the third trial is Fear the Reaper. Fear the Reaper is special. You need to summon the Soul Reaper and die from them. All right, so after overnight AFK farming, I have got exactly 5,000 bones. Now, if that <laughs> won't get me the hallowed essence, I'm not sure what will. Hey! So, uh, thank you, Test, for helping. This took forever. Woo! <laughs> right, so what you gotta do is come over here and die by the Soul Reaper. As you can see, it says loading. There we go. The Hell Dimension. Now I gotta find three. Oh, there's the first one. Ooh, there they are. There's the next torch. Da -da -dun. Did that not work? Does that mean I have to... Oh, never mind. There, there's um the last NPC that came out of absolutely nowhere. Like seriously, where would it come from? All right, next torch. They're probably not gonna come back until I move away. So back up. Yep, yeah, that was right. There they are. So if they fall off, you just have to go all the way away from them. Then, here we go, oh, shoot, this guy over there has dark fruit, come back down and he should be right there, almost there, done, let's go, the, uh, uh, <coughs> the last Alucard fragment, woo, now I've got six, so after you've done the scrolls, you can just talk to them again, and the scroll bursts into flames and disappears. It's for both of them. Boom. Now before I do that, you can only hurt the uh, person in there with either Toshida or Yamas. And I've got fruit stats, so I'm going to quickly change that. There we go. Now I can do max melee defense. And sword. Now I head back. The six shards of the legendary Alucard gem react to each other. Gem and you. Load it up into the door. And there we go. There it is. Luckily, it doesn't use any special moves. Alright, time for the last stretch. And my sword's changing. What's happened? My screen's black. I guess I'll just rejoin. Alright, I just rejoined. And here we go. The Cursed Jewel Katanas. That looks amazing. Yeah. Oh, and when you click it, it doesn't launch you forward so you can AFK. Oh, that's amazing. If you enjoyed or found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.